I'll be playing Duke Nukem 3D 20th Anniversary World Tour. Duke Nukem 3D just got a reboot for PS4, Xbox One, and Steam, loaded with new features and new levels. The game plays like a traditional first-person shooter, where you go around collecting weapons, ammo, health, and shooting anything that moves. You can interact with switches, key cards, and security cameras, while navigating incredibly clever labyrinths that put today's map design to shame. You can fly around with a jetpack, dive underwater, and stumble across pornography all while trying to find the detonate button to finish the round. There are about 40 different levels broken up into five episodes that are all completely accessible from the beginning. I had no trouble jumping back into the controls for Duke 3D. The only default changes I made were to run at all times and to use the left trigger to crouch. There are some gameplay mechanics that were built into the controls by design, like how there's a delay on switching weapons, or how you can't zoom or control the accuracy. And the turning makes me dizzy sometimes, especially during earthquakes. There's a map you can access in case you get lost. And there's a rewind feature in case you suck. The coolest and lamest feature of this game is the in-game commentary. This was such an awesome idea that should have been expanded upon. The big problem is only a handful of levels have commentary triggers, and they're clustered together, and the mixing is poor. Established a lot of the staples. The graphical and audio updates are minor but nice. I like how you can turn on the level stats to see how many secrets or enemies you're missing. But I wish there was some award or incentive for beating the par times or finding all the hidden areas. Oh, and what happened to local multiplayer? Overall, Duke Nukem 3D World Tour is a cool update that missed a few opportunities. Even so, I still think Duke 3D has the best map design of any first person shooter. What games have your favorite maps? Start a dialogue in the comments section, and hit the like button because your mother's not going to do it for you.